Greetings out there in YouTube land. This is Morris Man, and as always, I thank you guys for coming to my channel. As you can see, I got my one of my Just Dave t-shirts on. I miss Dave. And I'm proud to announce the unveiling of DVD bundle number eight, The Hits. Over 50 songs, $50, which is less than a dollar a lesson. And what's so special about this particular bundle is this. In my previous bundles, I try to give you guys the mixtures of mixtures of stuff or mixture of stuff that you've never probably heard on the radio. Some some B-side stuff that were good stuff, you know, and there were some people that appreciated that, you know, because there's some things that they like off of these other albums that were never released. So this time I thought I would, you know, discipline myself and give you nothing but the hits, meaning that all the songs that are listed down there, you've heard of. Or if not, they've been charted. They're charted hits. You know, so it won't be a thing that some people felt like, I'm getting fillers. You know, so, you know, I try to give you guys a variety of stuff and what packages that would, might fit for you personally. Because uh, I'm like this. I'm appreciative of the very noted artists. But I'm just as appreciative, if not more, of the ones that you don't hear every day. Because I'll give you a good example before I get into this. And uh, I make it a point when I do... Uh, some of my favorites, I, I, I make this statement. These are some of my personal favorites. I'm not going to say these are the best because if I do, I have a list of comments down there. What happened to this guy? He ain't on his list. You know, so I'm like, trying to avoid that because everybody's list should be different in the first place. Nobody should have the same identical list. And I did a, uh, a video on some of my favorite guitar players, some of my favorite, not the best favorites or the best players in the world. And, uh, I, and time to time I get somebody, oh, you didn't include this person. And then one particular person said you didn't include, include George Benson. George Benson is a gift. You know, it's like I'm not here to give uh, constant due to the obvious giants because they don't need it. What about the Kirk Coakley's? Probably never even heard of that guy. One of the baddest bass players in the 70s that ever played R&B funk in the 70s. Most guys don't even know about him. He played with a group called uh, T-Connection. And the piano player and the singer was his brother. You ought to check T Connection out. They were some bad guys, you know. So I try to, you know, do those types of things because, I mean, people used to always ask me, when you going to do some Jimi Hendrix? Why? 10 million people doing Jimi Hendrix on YouTube. Why do I need to be 10 million and one? Duh, you know. I'm trying to give you guys, you know, like a Kurt Coakley, you know, uh, obscure bands and you know bands that never got they do and it's like hey take a listen to this because this was some good stuff when it was happening but they just didn't get they do so you know that's what i try to do for the most part because i'm not trying to be like everybody else in that sense that i'm doing exactly what everybody else is doing because it's pointless it it, it it defeats the purpose if i'm doing what everybody else is doing and that's why i think a lot of people like my channel because they're like man where else can i hear some confunction b-side stuff or just some confunction stuff you know some uh you know, uh, brass construction, you know, and, and so on and so forth. But I'm sorry for digressing. Let me get back to this. So you get 50 duh hits and I'm going to I'm going to read off about 20 because I don't need to read all 50 because they all right down here listed. But I'm just giving you an idea of the stuff that's on here. Maze featuring Frankie Beverly. Happy feelings. I love that song. Maze is probably my all time favorite R&B song group. Uh, Rolls Royce wishing on a star. Very beautiful song, real easy song to play. It's only like three or four chords. Three chords and then the bridge, just another chord. Turn around. Uh, War, The World is the Ghetto. Very underrated band back in the day, War. Number four, Maze, again, Feel That You're Feeling. George Benson, Breezing, just the chords. I'm not doing the lead line because that's a personal stamp. And you know me, I don't do people, other people's solos. So I just thought I would mention that. Number six, Earth, Wind, and Fire. Let's groove. Number seven, Smokey Robson and the Miracles, Just a Mirage. Number eight, The Crusaders featuring Randy Crawford on vocals, Street Life. Love that song. Number R, number nine, R. Kelly, Step in the Name of Love. Number 10, The Bee Gees, Night Fever. Number 11, Tina Turner, What's Love Got to Do With? It? Number 12, The Whispers, Love is Where You Find It. Number 13, beautiful song, Robin Thicke, Lost Without You. Number 15, R. Kelly, Your Body's Calling. Number 16, Gloria Gaynor, Never Can't Say Goodbye. Number 17, Doris Troy, Just One Look. Number 18, Alicia Meyer, I Want to Thank You. Number 19, The Jones Girls, Who Can I Run To? Number 20, The Dash Man, Heartbeat. 
So I'm just going to, I'm going to stop there. But uh, again, <coughs> nothing but the hits, great songs, only $50. That includes shipping and handling unless you're outside the United States. Then you need to add an additional $15 for shipping and handling. Uh, if I were to tab these songs individually for you guys, because you know my tabbing service, $15 a lesson, two song minimum, $30. If I were to tab these songs at $15 a song for you guys, that would be $750. You only get this for 50 bucks. Literally pennies on the dollar as far as songs, because uh, my charge is $50. And then PayPal get their money off the top. Then the mailer costs. Then the blank DVDs. Then the shipping and handling. All that's factored in. You know, so it's less than a dollar lesson. And I want to stress this too. These are MP3 files, so when your DVDs come, play them on the, your PC. I even write on the DVDs, play on PC. Do not play on DVD player because they're not converted for DVD player. Play it. files because if they were, the files would be huge. You know, so I just thought I would mention that because some of the little things that people kind of overlook, you know, uh, they're there, but they don't realize that they're there. So I just thought I would make, you know, this statement. Also, uh. My PayPal information is right there. So once you submit payment, I will send you an email saying I got your money. Even though PayPal sent you an email saying, you know, uh, that guy got you sent that guy his money. Uh, please be sure before you send any money that in your PayPal account, you have your shipping address and you have your email address. Because without the shipping address, of course, I can't ship them out. Without your email address, I can't let you know that you receive. I receive your money, even though you know that by looking at your PayPal account. It's really important to have that information because, unfortunately, uh, every blue moon I get someone who don't have their email address. They don't have their shipping address, so I can't do nothing. I can't contact you to say I need your shipping address to ship it, or just send your email saying that I got your money and your DVDs to go out the next business day. With United States tracking. It's priority mail, so you know when it's leaving me and when it's coming showing up on your doorstep. So it's really important that you have that information because when you don't, this is what, exactly what happens 100% of the time. Somebody send me the money, no email address, no address, so I can't do nothing but wait till they realize it's been a week and a half and I ain't got my stuff. Hey, Morris, man, what's going on? That's because I don't have your email address, don't have your shipping address, so I can't ship it. So please, please be sure that you have that information before you even send me anything so that the transaction will go smoothly because uh, I sent out the DVDs the very next business day. So, uh, you know, I'm not dragging feet on your product. When you pay me, it goes out. So within five days, you got your item. And it's still up uh, five days. I just finally shipped it out, you know. Because there's some people that, you know, they kind of, Drag feet are so busy that they take a very long time. A lot of things were instilled in me by my dad. <clears throat> and a few of me is don't drag ass, don't drag feet. You know, uh, never ask another man for something you're not willing to pay for. You know, because uh, I get that a lot too. People send me a list of stuff. And they want it done. I'm like, it's unfair to the, you know, uh, the two Eddies, the Jamal. The Andres, you know, the list goes on, the disco dance that they pay me for my service. And you guys expect this, this for free. And it's just unfair. And I try to be fair because I'm like, it's not fair to do this for this group of people and do this for this group of people. But these group of people paying these people, group of people don't. And there are people that don't realize it because I don't think that they're trying to, you know, get over. They just don't realize that, uh. I got like 20,000 subscribers and I get a hundred, literally hundreds of requests a day. Even if I were to charge these people, I couldn't crank out that many for you guys. So please be mindful that uh, it's not just you. You know, uh, there are a lot of other people out there that want, you know, songs done. And, you know, it's not fair for me to do this for these people and then do this for these people and charge these people. So, uh, you know, I just from time to time thought that I would mention that because again people just don't realize the situation you know it's there's something it's they don't know what they don't know so it ain't again that they're I'm trying to get something for free from Morris man it's like no all these other people are paying because they're serious about learning these songs and it wouldn't be, be unfair to those people that I do all these for these other people for free so again I just thought I would stress that because again I don't take nothing for granted I don't assume anything or assume that you know everything so it's it's up to me to explain it you know and it's not uh, you know, I'm trying to be negative or it's being offensive or rude to anybody. By no means, I'm just trying to explain to you how things are so you can, you know, 
move accordingly. So uh, again, you get 50 songs, nothing but hits for $50, shipping and handling is including. My PayPal information is right down there. They're MP3 files, so when you get your DVDs, play them on your PC and not your DVD player. I just want to make sure I covered everything here. So yeah, I covered everything. So again, uh, PayPal information is right down there. Uh, once you submit payment, I will send you out your DVDs the next business day with United States tr tracking. Till next time, take care. Thanks for watching.